Hey guys, my third and last video. Sorry, the order of the videos was a little bit strange. Um, I, I looked at the first video I made not from today and I found out that the cover of the GoPro made the sound quality very bad. So I'm gonna make a new intro video of the bike when it's ready and what I've experienced with it. The other two videos is really bad sound because I'm still using the cover, but I don't wanna do them again. So let's just go over the bike again really quick. So I showed you of the ready-made bike before in the second video. There's nothing new. I haven't done anything else. Everything is just mounted as it should. The only thing I told, I said I was going to do, which I did, was put a lot of silicone here on the inside here, protecting the uh, well the center of the motor where the axle goes in from water from humidity, stuff like that. A lot of sil silicone on the inside here, put on the plug and put a lot of silicone around here. Uh, pretty sure it's helping, I don't know. Also, uh, the bag for the controller, uh, it hasn't been raining, so I've been lucky, but I still don't trust it. This is far away from the best uh, solution for, uh, for this electronic box here. So what I found out, I'm gonna buy some vinyl, a box, build a box, paint it black, Put it here to be to make sure this is water waterproof. Um, the other thing that I noticed, I've been running now for using the bike for three weeks now, and actually I've used it every day, or wherever I've been going for work or anything else. I'm very happy with the bike, I should say. The thing I noticed is somehow the the hub of the the wheel that came with the motor um, made the brake. Uh, the disc is only touching the pads on you can see here it should be a lot deeper with a with a uh, uh, it's just been friction here on the out outer lip if I should say. it should be deeper inside to the center so this is 160 mil maybe I should change for 180 or change the bracket so I get the the whole caliper closer to the center so we'll see still I have really good brakes so I'm not going to do anything about it. So the brakes is going to be fixed. I'm going to buy a, a, a newer tube. Thank you for the tip in the other video. <laughs> uh, because still the, this, uh, the valve is too short. So, But it works. And I hope in, during this summer I'm going to do something about it. And also this box. Well, yeah. Um, I can show you how much I've been riding. I'm riding now for three hours and 49. I don't reset the, the uh, yeah, what do you call it, the counter at all. I just follow up on the on the battery capacity and how many watts I get. And also here, you use the assist how much you want. I always use the number five. You get the most top speed. The other ones are the same torque, but you get lower top speed. What I do is every time I start pedaling, before I start uh, twisting the throttle because I think it's better for the engine so it doesn't get the fully load at once I'm not that heavy but still I don't know I think it's uh, the best I've gotten th about 30 over 30 kilometers out of the battery in three days then I will have only one pin left on the battery so I'm not sure maybe I can get 35 I didn't take any risk but I don't know, it's a, as I said, an 11.6 amps battery. Uh, if you uh, can find it and it's slim and fit your bike, I would go for the 20. I think uh, the c capacity of the battery is a little bit low, but what can you expect? I mean, you're supposed to pedal as well. I don't pedal at all. I just, uh, <laughs> I use this on almost like a, a scooter or a, a small motorbike. I'm very happy when I use it commuting for for work it's uh, just past all the cars because I've got the top speed of the bike is about just a little bit on flat ground no wind in the morning I get a little bit over 50 kilometers an hour very happy with that because the cars on that road are only allowed to go in 40 so I actually and the, I can choose smaller roads and well it's more efficient than my car absolutely very happy so 
probably not going to use the car that much this summer except for longer trips and other trips so um, what else well just happy it's the tires it's very good grip uh, as I said I haven't tried them on the wets yet but I pumped the, them up really hard so I don't know it's the grip is just awesome I can really lean the bike down in the corners and well just happy about it I found out that these crappy <laughs> crappy eBay uh, lighting that I bought is just well yeah as I said it's just crap so I'm gonna go for a, a, a real a bike light uh, here in the and buy in the city and forget about eBay so this is what happened I just popped off in the first bump just silly cheap plastic all right I don't think uh, I have anything more to say about the bike yeah yeah I just forgot about this I got one little issue here but I got a solution as well what happened uh, is that ooh, I'm gonna do it I'm gonna change hand you can see on the on the motor there are scratches on the on the color here on the metal what happened is that the, the gear arm when I put it in the lightest gear the gear arm uh, of course it scratched the the, the engine so what I've done I've just adjusted the gears so I, I won't be using the, the lightest gear anyway I'm not pedaling as I said so it's always on these two gears the second uh, heaviest and the heaviest gear so uh, yeah that's the only issue I had so maybe there's another solution on that but that's my solution all right I'm gonna show you two more videos of some riding sorry again for the bad sound quality on those two there's some a little bit of wind today and that cover on this camera is not making it any easier all right see you okay so uh, i can feel a little bit difference when the battery is uh, fully charged i get even more power from the from the engine and the battery uh, here i can see how many watts i use uh, of course full throttle will give me a thousand watts so but as i said i don't know the electronics but i can actually feel the difference from when it's fully charged and i give full throttle and it's let's say at 50 percent i don't know why but i know it is all right here we go so this is the throttle i'm not gonna i've been actually uh, what i've been doing start pedaling because I think it's probably good for the engine to get some help from the start so yeah let's go 